In this video, we're going over how to mirror your LG Stylo 6 to your TV. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the mobile technology coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time we post new videos. Today we're going to show you how to mirror your LG Stylo 6 to your TV. There are three things you will need to make this work. The first thing is going to be an HD TV with an HDMI input. The second thing is you will need home Wi-Fi. And the third thing is you will need a Chromecast device. I'm going to show you two ways to mirror your screen today. The first method is how to mirror everything on your screen, exactly what you're doing onto the TV. The second method is gonna be just mirroring a video from a video app to your TV. Let's go ahead and jump right in. The first thing you'll need to do is go to the Play Store and you'll need to download the Google Home app. Just do a search and just type in Home and look for this app and you're gonna open this up. And you will need to swipe down from the bottom of your screen and make sure your Wi-Fi is turned on and you are connected to Wi-Fi. And also make sure you're on the same Wi-Fi network as uh, your Chromecast. Now I'll walk you through the setup process really quickly here. Make sure you're signed into your Gmail, select OK, hit Next. I select only while using the app here. And basically it's going to look for, actually we can go ahead and skip this step right here. Um, it's gonna take us to our home screen. And on the home screen, you will notice these two icons. You're gonna look for this icon right here. And tapping on that icon is going to um, take us to this screen. And at the bottom, you're gonna tap cast my screen. Cast screen. Start now. And as you'll notice, now my screen is mirrored to the TV. And so anything I do on the phone now is gonna automatically show up on the TV. So that's why this is a really cool option. Uh, and I like to use this option for things like, oh, we're on a trip and I wanna show people videos or I have a funny video of my kid that I wanna show. You know, I'll normally switch on the Chromecast and use this option. You can also use it to show gameplay. If there's a cool game you're playing and you wanna show someone how you play it, you can mirror the whole thing to the TV and it'll all show up at the same time. You can also play videos in this option as well. If you didn't wanna go on YouTube, you could find a video and simply play it, but it's a little bit more work to make it happen. So for this video, for example, I'd have to take the phone and then rotate it sideways or tap on the icon here. And this is how you would get a full screen video to play uh, in this setting. Now, the reason I don't like this setting for playing video specifically, especially a movie, is you can't use your screen. Your screen is stuck to whatever you have mirrored to the TV. If you're just trying to show a video, there's a better way and I'll show you that right now. We're gonna get out of this video here and we're simply going to Swipe down from the top of the screen to get back to our Chromecast. What's up to my man Trent Marshall, killing the game. And you're gonna look for this option here that says cast screen. And if you swipe down with two fingers, you can tap on disconnect and it will stop mirroring your screen to the TV. Okay, so now what I wanna do is I wanna go to a video and I'm gonna show you a different way again to make this work. Sorry, the video totally closed on me. So I'm not trying to show uh, one of those videos. So I'm gonna to go to the same video now. And what you're gonna do is in the upper right corner, look for this option, this little icon. This is your cast icon. Uh, if you tap on this, this will allow you to just send the video directly to the TV without having it show everything on your phone. Uh, you'll see this icon in just about every video app, Netflix, Hulu, YouTube, just look for that in the corner of the video. And here I'm gonna tap cast two and I'm gonna select my Chromecast. And now you'll see this video is gonna start playing, but just the video on the TV, nothing else. So now the video is playing, you can still control the volume from your phone on the side here. But now I can close the app here and I can do other things. I can go and search the web, I can go on Messenger, I can be texting. Your phone is fully functional to do whatever you wanna do while that video is playing. I think the video is in the intro stage so that's why you don't see anything happening but the video is playing right now. And you can still control the video from the notification panel just swiping down. 
I can pause the video from here, unpause it, or I could hit the X here to stop it playing altogether. But that's it. So essentially that's how you marry your screen to the TV. You've got two different methods there. Now I wanna point out if you do have a Roku or Fire Stick TV or any one of the Amazon devices, you can use the second method to mirror your screen, um, but the first method won't work. For the first method where you're mirroring the entire screen, everything you're doing, you have to have a Chromecast for that. But for the second option of just playing a video from your phone, it will work with a Fire TV Stick or a Chromecast. Um, or uh, a Roku. Now, you can also use it with Apple TV, but there's some extra steps you've got to do for that. So just an important note there. In the description below, I'll have a link of where you can purchase a Chromecast. I'll have a video that will show you how to set up a Chromecast if you don't know how. And we also have a cool accessory store for all our LG Stylo 6 recommendations, like best accessories and different things for your phone. So check out that too. Anyway, I hope you guys did find the video helpful. Like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care, and as always, have a good one.